your gynecologist recommended that you undergo a hysterectomy, or have you already had a hysterectomy performed on you because you have abnormal menstrual bleeding and fibroids or maybe endometriosis? I'm Dr. Steve Hotze. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow me on Facebook at Hotze Health. Have you had abnormal and dysfunctional uterine bleeding that has caused your gynecologist to recommend that you undergo a hysterectomy? There are approximately 600,000 hysterectomies performed on American women every year, most of which are completely unnecessary. The primary uh, non-urgent or non-emergency reasons for performing a hysterectomy are abnormal dysfunctional uterine bleeding that often happens as a woman marches through her menstrual life associated with fibroid tumors, which are benign, and maybe endometriosis. Those are the predominant reasons. 90 or 95 percent of the time, these are the reasons that a doctor would recommend a hysterectomy. The doctor would tell you, well, we can stop that abnormal bleeding, get rid of that fibro, we'll just cut out your uterus. Well, guess what? There was a cause for your uterus to have abnormal bleeding and a fibroid, and that comes from a problem caused by an imbalance between your two main female hormones, estrogen and progesterone. As you march through your menstrual life, you make both these hormones, and they balance out every month. You start making estrogen hormones right after your period. That continues to increase all the way until day 28 of your cycle, or 27, at which time your ovaries would quit making hormones, you'd slough the inner lining of the womb. In the middle of the month, when you ovulate, that estrogen hormone is balanced by progesterone. As women march through their menstrual life, their progesterone levels, which are also derived from the ovary, as are the estrogen, begins to decline. And estrogen becomes the dominant hormone, estrogen dominance. The opposite side of that coin is progesterone deficiency, cause the inner lining of the woman to womb to beef up and begins to have heavy periods and clotting and the doctor says we'll just cut out the womb but it hasn't addressed the underlying problem which is an imbalance between the estrogen and progesterone this can be easily corrected and you can prevent from having to have a hysterectomy by simply taking progesterone when you begin to have symptoms of abnormal or breakthrough bleeding or premenstrual symptoms mood swings fluid retention headache breast tenderness these are some of the early signs of progesterone deficiency, which can happen right after puberty, but commonly happen in midlife around 35 or 40 in women. So a hysterectomy is preventable if it's simply being done for abnormal bleeding, fibroids, or maybe endometriosis. These can be corrected with the use of natural bioidentical progesterone. I'm not talking about birth control pills. They don't contain the natural hormones. I'm talking about simply adding natural progesterone during your menstrual cycle on day 15 through 28. I'm Dr. Hotze. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Facebook at Hotze Health.